John and Blair. Thank you, Molly. Well, the change in police pursuit policies is the goal of the NAACP in St. Louis City and County. And Fox 2's Ty Hawkins is live this morning from the St. Louis County Central County Precinct with details on the briefing happening this morning. Good morning to you, Ty. The NAACP of St. Louis City and St. Louis County, they want to change how police pursue in chases. And this comes after five family members were killed in May after a crash over in West St. Louis. The organization has spoken with city and county police about their pursuit policies. They also got the Department of Justice to help preview those policies. The NAACP plans to share their findings at a news conference this morning at 10. Now, in a letter to police, the group said data collection on police pursuits makes a strong case for opting not to pursue. Five members of one family died in a crash with a driver in a stolen Jeep fleeing police. That happened Mother's Day weekend along Del Mar Boulevard in West St. Louis. Police said later they had no information that police were actually pursuing that Jeep, but officers did try to use spike strips. 18-year-old Marshawn Stepney is charged in the crash. He has another court hearing scheduled today. The 18-year-old is facing 17 charges, including second-degree murder. He's being held without bond. A relative of the five family members killed in May says changes are needed. We have to find a better way, a better alternative, because too many lives have been taken away, too many innocent people. Something has to get done. St. Louis has to change. That press briefing is scheduled for 10 this morning at the St. Louis County NAACP chapter. We will be covering that for you again. It is at 10 this morning, that press briefing. Reporting live in St. Louis County, Ty Hawkins, back to you.